<laughs> I'm sorry. No. <laughs> 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 Richard McDonald had always loved Sleepy Sludgeside with its jittery jolly jungle. It was a place where he felt surprised. He was a proud, deranged tea drinker with solid legs and sloppy eyes. His friends saw him as a gigantic, gentle gamer. Once, he had even revived an eyeing injured bird. It was the sort of man he was. Richard walked over to the window and reflected on his wild surroundings. The sleep ran like walking monkeys. Then he saw something in the distance, or rather, someone. It was a bigger white fish. Mike was a forgetful writer with long legs and skinny eyes. Richard Gulf, he was never heard of Mike. As Richard stepped outside and Mike came closer, he could see the tiny glint in his eyes. <laughs> Keep going. I am here because I want to fight, Mike. I am here because I want to fight! He slammed his fist against Richard's chest with a force of 6,427 rats. Kirk Douglas Punch! Ugh. I freaking love you, Richard McDonald. I freaking love you, Richard McDonald. Richard looked back, even more sad, and still fingering the spotty calculator. Mike Doe, he replied. Doe! <laughs> they looked at each other, each other with sad feelings, like two mutated magnificent mice <laughs> smiling at each other at a very giving funeral, which had easy music playing in the background. <laughs> and two intelligent animals cooking to the beat. Suddenly, Mike lunged forward and tried to punch Richard in the face. Kirk Douglas! Squiggly, Richard scratched the spotty guy and brought it down Mike's skull. <laughs> Mike's tall legs dribbled and, and his skinny eyes wobbled. He looked barby, his body raw like a new nice newspaper. <laughs> then he let out. Then he let out an agonizing <laughs> oh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Moments later, Mike Fish was dead. Richard McDonald went back inside and made himself a nice cup of tea.